What up, Savage Squad? It's your boy, No Rico Side, bringing you another video. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys what I do for work. I got my work outfit on right now. But before we get started, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Let's go. So this is the work fit. Button-up shirt is mandatory. You can wear shorts or jeans, but if you wear shorts, this has to be the material. Compression shorts, I gotta have them, or I'ma start chafing like crazy, I ain't gonna lie to you. So a couple things I gotta have before I leave the door. AirPods, gotta have them. Gotta stay in my own zone. Car keys, I don't know how I'ma get there without them. Hydrate, water, always. Arizona weather, dangerous. Same situation here too. Can't go to work without them because of the hard concrete floor. Nike Zoom X, these are my practice track shoes too. If you ever get a chance, buy a pair, you won't regret it. Don't forget who put you on though. Yeah, y'all ready for work, man. Let's get it. So before we clock on, we always have to do our health check due to COVID. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do now. I like to do it while I'm on the way to work, so I'm not wasting any time while I'm at the machine, the punching machine. All right, y'all, we jamming to some uh, Polo G. We in the car, we heading to Home Depot, ready for our shift. We got five minutes till we gotta clock on. So yeah, see so now we pulling up. Yeah, we in the break room now. Time to punch in. Punch in machine is right here. After I clock in, I have my locker. Say what's up to Austin. Yeah. And then we get to the locker. I got some training to do on the computer. That's nothing. We just do that another day. Get in here. Got the snacks in here. Say what's up to the boy Jeremiah, you know, we eating good today, like always, you know, trying to get big, my guy. All right, now it's time to say what's up to my associates, you know, we're all in the same department, so here at Home Depot, Lowe's, whatever you want to call it. We just picking orders today. Banging through these fucking orders, trying to get to the end of the fucking day right here. Yes, sir. You heard him. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? All right, guys, so we are ready to pick some orders. So we're gonna go into the OFA order fulfillment um, app. We got bonuses, car deliveries, deliveries, wheel calls, and boss orders. But now we are working on boss orders. So these are orders that have been ordered from a customer off the website and the customer will be picking up from the store so i got a pallet jack and we're just gonna be placing them somewhere for when the customer comes he you know where to order it. and just making sure we know what location they're in. It just came off the truck. Now I'm taking it to PR1, putting some stickers on the order and waiting for the customer to pick it up. That's about it. Okay, so now we are in PR1 with the rest of the deliveries and orders. I'm gonna drop this pallet. Go and get a sticker. Verify the order, find the customer's name, click verify. Go to printer, click print. Print out three, four stickers. Printer doesn't work well. Most of the time it doesn't print all the stickers that you need. And we're 
we're gonna be placing these stickers on order. I'm gonna place these stickers on just like that. Awesome. This order is ready to go. Mark the location as PR001. Attention associates, new order. All right, customers here for the order. Um, here to grab the order for the customer, and we are going to after he is finished with this because we have to get it from PR1. All right, I'm holding this paper like this because I don't want to put the customer's name on it. But we are grabbing a order for the customer, and we're waiting for the forklift to move before we can grab this order. Here's the order for the customer sitting back here with the rest of the orders um they're gonna be at the loading zone so yeah you ready to hand them their order right good uh or? yeah here's the Are order you for you yeah i think it's already signed off looks good yep, yep. that's it Crazy. awesome you have a good night all right y'all now it's time to take a 15 minute break after working two hours you get a 15 minute break so i got the mac and cheese Woo! is inside the microwave Fall ball is macaroni time. I was just playing, but you always want to make sure you bring something tasty for your breaks, you know. It's my mac and cheese and uh, vinegar, salted chips. Not sure whose birthday it is, but thanks for the cupcakes. So we got some cabinets to pick today, and that's what we doing. cabinets we could get right now we got the order taking it back to pre r1 put some stickers on it and getting it ready for a truck yes sir <laughs> so this order was a delivery it's gonna go out on a truck so i got a customer that needs this light and is not on the shelf so i'm gonna put these gloves on and pull it down First, we gotta close the aisle then. Right, guys so we're going up now <laughs> Adam tiny he's talking to those customers look how tiny you look from here <laughs> but yeah make sure we close this back up Close this gate, make sure it's secured. All right guys, so now we're up here and we're gonna make sure that this is closed. Cause you know, we don't want none of this falling on any customers. That'll be a bad lawsuit. And now we are heading back down. Adam over there in that corner. Look at Tiny. <laughs> My guy. That's it though. Get a little bit. Hit the horn a couple times. Got the lights that the customer needed. There they are. Now we can open up the aisles. Put this Ballymore back. 
Here we go. All right, guys, so we got a Bopis on the phone. meaning that I could not see the order. So I had to walk all the way back to the other side of the building to get that phone. Silly me. And you've got the little caps, plastic caps. Oh, uh, the wires? You have to seal the wires, the little plastic the cups. Mm. Adam, we need some help. <laughs> We're looking for plastic little seal caps so that your wires are not exposed. Like, you know your wires are hanging like we, before you put in your uh, um, ceiling fan. You want to cap them, the little cups that you put in the wires. Oh, the wire nuts. Oh, wire nuts. <laughs> I didn't know that. Okay. <laughs> well, I didn't know either. <laughs> I didn't know that that exposed. <laughs> I thought you meant like exposed like you don't want to see them hanging out. Oh, right. All right, I am finally able to finish this order. It was just a couple items left, and now I'm going to be able to put the order up. Okay, squad. So manager asked me to come out here and water plants today. Garden associate didn't show up for a shift. So that's what I'm be doing. Uh, we're gonna take care of it. Let's go. Hey, check this out, bro. I know you ain't never seen no colorful uh cactuses and shit, man. Look at that. Yeah, that shit different right there. Them motherfuckers. Man, that's different. Got the cactuses over here. What else we got over here? beautiful sunset man so i've been working for home depot for about three years now i've worked at a location in st louis and two here in arizona one in peoria and down here in tempe home depot is a great company don't get me wrong but if you got into this point in this video you realize that it's very boring straightforward um i'm looking for a job that you know is a little bit more challenging uh this gets pretty boring and when i say challenging i mean it in like a mental standpoint something that will challenge your brain something that you don't understand and want to all right y'all now we watering the, the palm trees out here man these things drink like once a month i ain't gonna lie but <clears throat> we got some small ones right here they're gonna get big just like that one But yeah, they need a drink too. It's hot out here, man. It's probably like 113 right now. That Phoenix weather ain't no joke. We got some more over here too. We gonna get them right though. Don't trip.
Alright, Savage Squad, man. The sun is down. It's hot as hell out here still. That's just how Phoenix be, though. You know, we got the trees watered. We got the flowers watered. It's time to clock out. Please like and subscribe. You know, we're trying to build this channel. Let's get it to a thousand subscribers, man.